In a significant move towards modernizing the U.S. Army's artillery capabilities, South Korean defense company Hanwha Defense has introduced a cutting-edge wheeled self-propelled howitzer designed specifically for U.S. military needs. This innovative system combines the advanced K9A2 turret with a robust MAC Defense military truck chassis, marking a pivotal step in the Army's next-generation howitzer, NGH program. This initiative aims to enhance artillery performance following the cancellation of the Extended Range Cannon Artillery ERCA program. The U.S. Army has recognized the pressing need for an upgraded self-propelled howitzer to replace its aging M109 Paladin, which has been in service since the 1960s. Despite numerous upgrades, the M109 has become increasingly outdated in light of contemporary warfare requirements. The NGH program represents the Army's fourth major attempt to develop a self-propelled howitzer with extended range and improved mobility, reflecting the findings of a comprehensive 2023 study that prioritized artillery modernization. This study, completed in March 2024, underscored the necessity for more autonomous, longer-range, and highly mobile artillery solutions. One of the standout features of Hanwha's new howitzer is its wheeled configuration, which offers superior mobility compared to traditional tracked versions. Wheeled howitzers can traverse roads and rough terrain more swiftly, facilitating rapid repositioning and response times, an essential requirement in today's fast-paced military operations. Additionally, they are easier and more cost-effective to maintain, providing significant logistical advantages. With automation reducing crew sizes and enhancing operational efficiency, Hanwha's self-propelled howitzer promises the U.S. Army the versatility and mobility vital for future combat scenarios where speed, range, and survivability will be critical. The new howitzer, based on the MAC Defense truck chassis, features a crew cab at the front and the advanced K9A2 turret mounted at the rear. It boasts an impressive rate of fire, capable of delivering 9 rounds per minute, with a burst fire capability of 3 rounds within 15 seconds. The system can carry 30 rounds of 155mm ammunition and 192 charges, with a rapid readiness to fire in less than 30 seconds. At the heart of the design is the K9A2 turret, an evolved version of South Korea's renowned K9 Thunder self-propelled howitzer. This turret is equipped with a 155mm-52 caliber gun, which can fire up to 10 rounds per minute. Its efficiency is enhanced by automation that reduces crew requirements from 5 to just 2 or 3 personnel. Weighing less than 39 tons, the system is easily transportable by C-17 military aircraft ensuring it remains a highly mobile asset for rapid deployment. The K9A2 turret also delivers exceptional firepower, with a conventional range of 40 km and up to 50 km with advanced projectiles like the US-made M982 Excalibur precision-guided rounds. This level of performance is complemented by a fully automatic turret and auto-loading system, which bolster sustained fire capability while enhancing protection and efficiency on the battlefield. As the U.S. Army moves forward with plans to replace its aging fleet of M109 Paladin howitzers, Hanwha's offering is poised to compete against other mobile artillery systems. The need for modernization is evident as the Army seeks to address the challenges posed by evolving combat scenarios through 2040 and beyond. Hanwha's wheeled self-propelled howitzer promises improved mobility, enhanced crew survivability, and greater firepower, essential elements for maintaining artillery effectiveness in future conflicts. In conclusion, Hanwha Defense's innovative self-propelled howitzer represents a significant advancement in artillery technology, aligning with the U.S. Army's vision for a modernized and capable artillery force. As the competition unfolds, the integration of cutting-edge design, advanced automation, and superior mobility will be crucial in determining the future of U.S. Army artillery.